Hello everyone, Prince the Bear here. Today we're hanging out at Disney Springs to go check out Bongos. Bongos. Uh, Before it closes forever. Closes, closes forever. Whoever's gonna be here next. But uh, this restaurant's always been, been kind of sitting here, and we've never been. It just kind of hangs out in front of uh, the AMC movie theater. But we are finally taking the time to check it out. Like she said, before it goes away. I've walked past it for years. I didn't know it's actually Gloria Estefan's restaurant. Didn't know that. Mm -hmm. Makes sense, though. But, uh, so, Cuban food, right? Yeah, Cuban food. Can't go wrong there. So, let's go check it out. Um, leave us a comment, let us know where you'd like to go next, and uh, we'll see you soon. Be sure to subscribe. <laughs>
see the princess fighting somebody brutally over this rice. Extremely good. Right up her alley, I think. Bear wise, it's a bit, a little bit on the dry side, but three and a half out of five claws, I think. So I got the tour of Cuba, which comes with obviously, uh, apparently, I didn't know, a ton of onions. It's like buried in onions. It's like the meat died and they put onions on top of it. So what we have is their cook, slow cooked pork, great beef, shredded chicken. All the part in the pork perfectly. Local to perfection. It's like if string cheese was chicken or pork in this case. Beef is a nice deep flavor. It's even more like falling apart than the pork is. So good. As for the chicken, it literally feels like a tour of the island, I would say. I give the pork five out of five claws, the beef a three out of five, it's good but not as good as the other two, and then a chicken a four out of five. Who does my plantains? Hello everybody, Princess the Bear, and we just finished it at Bongo's. Um, I'm still waiting to get my hearing back. It's loud. Stupid loud. You go there for like family entertainment because there's like stuff they do, they dance around the restaurant and stuff, they've got dancers, and they take your picture for free. If you want to go have a dinner with your family and you don't want to talk to them, perfect place, That's to, place go. to go. place to go, yeah. you couldn't you hear them anyway. Talk. We might even have to do voiceover on this video because yeah. the music was so loud that you you, you yell it in the us. mic and I, I could barely hear me. It it was loud. It was really loud. The food was good. Decent. Wasn't not my favorite. Not food. my favorite. It was alright. The service I thought was kind of meh. Like I didn't really like the way he approached me. Or, or and you where he's just like whoa well you're allergic to something well you tell me what you want to eat and I will tell you if you can eat that or not yeah it was, it was really so kind of like I didn't like that step on the landmine I'll tell you if you're gonna die or not but well yeah. it wasn't the best ever set of Disney Springs but the food wasn't I don't know like I kind of felt like a little let down I didn't really think the food was that great honestly it was okay I mean I'd probably have Cuban food again I'm not eat there again I can understand why it's closing Honestly, it's probably, I mean... It's next Jaleo's to Jaleo, right here, it's, kind of, so. it's kind of a problem. Yeah. <laughs> kind of a problem, because Jaleo's food service is a lot better. Go to Leo. Yeah, we do that. We go, go go watch our video in the, in the description. Yeah. From Jaleo, go there. much better restaurant. And it, cool. it's about the same price, honestly. Yeah, it, it really is, so, so it's not worth it. Definitely check it out. All the drinks are better at Jaleo. Oh yeah. Yeah. Everything's better at Jaleo. Yeah. But, uh, leave us a comment, let's know where you want to go next, and, uh, be sure to subscribe. You heard the girl.